1921, when Bob French Sr. moved his Philadelphia real estate company, French Real Estate, to Ocean City, New Jersey, a beachfront property could be had for a mere $20,000. In the year 2000, the average home in Ocean City sold for $165,000. Just nine years later, that same home sold for $530,000 in 2009. That's accounting for the dip in real estate prices across the nation. Ocean City has seen its ups and downs throughout the 88 years French has been selling homes and businesses in America's greatest family resort, Ocean City, New Jersey. But two things have always remained constant. That being, Ocean City is a great place to live, work, and play, and an absolutely fabulous town to raise a family. The other is the fact that Ocean City real estate values have always withstood any downturn in the national economy. Today, we visit with Dustin Peters, a top French sales associate and resident. For the past 20 years, Dustin's presenting 30 Ocean Road, a terrific single-family home located in the beautiful and quiet garden section of Ocean City. Dustin? But for our purposes today, I want to talk about single families. The one behind us is 30 Ocean Road. I know a great deal about the house. It'll be the second time I do. This particular one is listed for $709,500, and Dan's going to go in and take some interior pictures. I guess I'd like to wrap up by saying that um, I decided to stay in my convertible because I tend to spend a lot of time in this car driving around seeing owners because I live in this area I work in this area and our office French real estate is in this area hey okay, most important things Dustin at beachnotes.net that's my that's my email Dustin at beachnotes.net uh, I have an 888 number if you are out of town 888-215-9935 I like working with people who are new to the area. I, I like driving around showing you various aspects of, of, of a lifestyle change. When you buy a second home or a shore property for any reason, it's a lifestyle change. French real estate, Dustin Peters. Hope to see you. Dan, one of the things here is this is a 1930s property. And at the same time... 1930s, that means it was built in 1930? 1930s. Wow. It's a, it blends the old and the new. Well, I never would have guessed. the size of this door. You don't see that everywhere. That is a big door. You're now in the sunroom here, Dan. And one thing nice about the sunroom is you can... It leads right into the into the uh, living room and so consequently have conversations on both both the uh, rooms. Notice the hardwood floor. Uh, going out we're going to move out into a five window dining room off here to your right. Wow. And we don't have any lights on and you it's can cozy, see. It's uh, a cozy home you got here. Yeah that's pretty nice. The uh, dining room is probably bigger than you need, but whenever you need a big one, you got it here. Well, you're not kidding. Let me get a light on in here if I can. They, they renovated the kitchen. So the kitchen is a blend of the old and the new. Uh, as you're walking in, you're seeing part of the new. You can get over to the other side. What you're going to see is they kept a section here of the old cabinets and uh, so you have a little area successfully blending the old yeah, with the new absolutely nice touch is a, a downstairs bedroom it's not large it's now used as an office it could be a den and it could be a bedroom there's a half bath in the back okay let's Great go home. upstairs instead right. of leaving them the original uh, stain uh, they, they did a couple funky colors in here for one of their grandchildren. Uh, another one over here. <laughs> I guess a Barbie fan in here, yeah, right? That's right. Uh, this is uh, an original bathroom. One thing you see with these white tiles, white subway tiles there, 
is that's, uh, that depicts the age of this house. And they kept them in, of course. Over here's another one. Notice the angles off the little closet on the side. Same is true over here. See this alcove over here in the corner. Cozy. And yeah, and then, then they in here they've renovated the bathroom so you can get that shower. So okay. oh, nice. Well, this is the one that's listed for seven seven hundred and nine thousand five hundred. It's the most shown property in our uh, repertoire right now. Wow. Beautiful property, Dustin. Uh, thanks, Dan. And uh, this has uh, been on the market. Just yeah, it's been only been on the market for less than a month. Wow. So uh, yeah, this is uh, this is a great one for a second home. It could be a rental property. And it could be a year-round property. I was going to say, just it's a great neighborhood. It's five-minute you know? walk to the beach. You know, absolutely, right? Just right down the street from the beach, and it's uh, just a beautiful, nice, quiet neighborhood. Let me show you the back outside. All right. French real estate, Dustin Peters. Hope to see you.